One of the most controversial New Deal programs was the Federal Theater Project. What was the Federal Theater Project? Why was it so controversial? The Federal Theater Project, or FTP, was organized in August of 1935. Its goal was to employ as many out-of-work actors, directors, and artists as possible. Aside from employing the actors and other performers, the Federal Theater Project also had the secondary mission of entertaining the nation. Actors, singers, and dancers performed shows all across America, providing a much-needed escape from the economic realities of the Great Depression. In its four-year history, it employed 12,700 workers in 31 different states. This program not only employed actors, but producers, directors, and scriptwriters as well. Carpenters were employed to construct sets. Seamstresses were hired to design costumes, and unskilled workers were brought in to be ticket takers and work behind the scenes in many other capacities. Several actors, writers, and directors who worked with the FTP would go on to greater fame later in their careers. Arthur Miller, John Houseman, and Orson Welles are just a few of the names who participated in FTP projects. Houseman and Wells collaborated with Mark Blitzstein on the controversial FTP production titled The Cradle Will Rock. The FTP produced more than 1,200 plays and put on 1,000 performances a week. An estimated 30 million people saw FTP produced plays. This gave the organization an extraordinary amount of influence over American opinion. This is why the organization became controversial as time progressed. Some felt that the plays and musicals produced by the FTP were far too politically opinionated. There were those in Congress who did not feel that a government agency should be producing what they believed was propaganda. For example, one production was extremely critical of the Supreme Court. Another production promoted worker rights and encouraged laborers to go on strike. One play, Revolt of the Beavers, was criticized for being pro-communist. Revolt of the Beavers was particularly troubling to many because it was targeted specifically at children. It was the controversial nature of these productions which eventually led to the end of the FTP. Congress disapproved of the program and canceled its funding on June 30, 1939.